Well, hi. <laughs> hey. Well, hi again. Welcome back to part two. I thought it would be fun to get both of us on camera since this was shot four months ago and we're way better looking now. Yeah, look how much better we look. Wow, it's crazy. <laughs> it's only getting better from here, guys. Yeah, well, this is a pretty cool one. I love getting your truck and going to the hot springs and uh, just having an adventure. Really magical. This is a six-part series and only gets weirder in every single part, so uh, buckle up and I'll keep them coming to you. Buckle up, buttercup. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs> Ta-da. Ta -da. Um, windy night. Yeah, it was very windy. It's still windy. <laughs> it got cold uh, a couple hours ago. Yeah. <laughs> now we're awake. The sun's coming up. and uh, Yeah, we were going to try to do a fire this morning and do coffee again, but it's, it's really windy now. So. And Cole's cold. Yeah, I'm cold. Cold, cold. I'm cold. I've lost like 40 pounds and like when you lose weight like you just you can't retain warmth at all. So not that Richard's not cold. That's why I gained all my weight back. <laughs> yeah, like legitimately no. though like <laughs> no. that, was, that was the reason why I gained weight back. <laughs> Actually the, the other thing I really hate too is like you when you fucking hit your elbows and shit on stuff. Like once you get skinnier. Oh because they're all uh, bony. Yeah, it's awful. It's the worst. We're in New Mexico. I'm eating like the most delicious red delicious I've ever had. Sounds mushy to me. You you look mushy. I am mushy. I need to get on my unfattening self. Unfatten yourself. Yeah, that's what I said. Get on that. We jumped into mountain time, so we gained an hour. We left super early this morning because it was windy and we weren't going to be able to do a fire. And my voice is cracking. And so now it's like super early in the day. We only have like 82 miles left. It's gonna be the most beautiful 82 miles. Richard's gonna give you a lot of footage because we're gonna be going through a canyon run. And soon enough, we're gonna have a brand new 1992 Lance Camper on the back of this truck. You know it's windy where you can't even wear the hat with the string because like it's getting knocked <laughs> off of your head even with the string on. And then it chokes you. Yeah. Wow. Let the anxious smoking miles. begin. Continue straight. It's really windy. What do you think, man? Great view. It's snowing! Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's crazy, this lake is frozen over. I hope I brought the right clothing. <laughs> Guys, so much has happened. I'm so sorry I just picked you up now, but the fun's begun. We got the camper top. Let's take a look. Oh, it's a redneck dream come true. I mean, it looks like it fits the truck. That's all I can say. It was quite the bitch to get this thing on. All right, I'll watch the news and I'll find out what's going on with the snow. Thank you, Miss Evelyn. Goodbye. We're three hours south, but she said that a storm is coming tomorrow. 
So if we don't get the bus tomorrow morning, bright and early, the storm's gonna be Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So we either go super early and get it tomorrow in the morning and then figure out what to do or we find some things to do for the next three or four days and then we go up afterwards. Currently exhausted. Um, we tried to go to the hot springs, but the road was like crazy. And uh, we didn't have like the proper tie downs for the camper yet, so we decided to go back to Taos, hit Ace, get a couple things for the camper. Honestly, with the right tie downs, I don't think that's a road I'm gonna be able to manage uh, in the future. So we'll see, only time will tell, but a um, little disappointed, super tired. We woke up way too early from our camping location in Texas. We've just like worked our ass off with this camper and we don't know where we're sleeping tonight. It's good to be on the road. Well, this is gonna be our first resting spot for the evening with the new truck camper. We're right next to a gorge. Gonna walk over and take a look. We also got some new chains. Got those set up on the back and the front. The sun has uh, retreated to the mountains. I don't think I realized we drove over this bridge. It's way cooler underneath it than it is on top of it. <laughs> Not a bad view. Over there. What you doing, Cole? Make a little Caesar salad kit. Haven't broken into the propane stove oven situation yet, but it is functioning. We're just kind of doing a salad sandwich situation for dinner. Shout out to Chris Penn, Zeppelin Travels, Tiny Home Tours. He let us use his Mr. Buddy heater and it's really helping warm up this truck camper right now. It's going to be a low of 25 tonight. Hey, we, sh we sure know how to have a feast. Caesar salad, amazing sandwich. Sandwich, Caesar, Chip chips, and salsa. salsa, Crown Royal. Whiskey and Dr. Pepper. Definitely not living that bachelor life. <laughs> mm. We uh, converted the dinette to a sleeping quarters. Got my queen up here. Oh yeah. Almost a, almost a twin, but I'm a fatal oh, that, sleeper. That's so. more than a twin. Oh yeah. It's, I think dude, that's this, a full. This thing is sweet. I'm excited. Luxury. We've got the light coming from my DeWalt flashlight right now. We'll figure out things as we oh, go. You took your shoes off already? Took my shoes off. Oh, I'm taking mine off I'm right in now. relaxation mode. Uh, I've had those shoes on all day. Let those puppies breathe. Oh, yeah. We're ready to lay down, get horizontal. <laughs> it smell a like, bit. smell like a bunch of dudes in here. Uh, well, <laughs> what better smell can you have than that? I think that's opinion based. <laughs> Coffee in the camper for the first time. I'm ready. Look, I'm not sponsored by Gatorade. Yeah. <laughs> New Gatorade water. Hey, Richard. Hello. Tamara. Hey. Um, we're going to go to the hot springs now. So you guys may recall me being bummed out yesterday because the truck couldn't go down the dirt road to the hot springs. And then it came up in conversation today and we were offered a ride to the hot springs. So now we're back. Um, we're in Tamara's home right now. It's wonderful. I'm actually in her bed, so. First day. <laughs> First day, just <laughs> Stay on top of the tracks. Yeah. Tiny, teeny one. <laughs> That'll be good for his thigh. This place sucks. Nature sucks. We've all come together and realized that this is the first time we've ever been to a hot spring. So we're really hoping this isn't disappointing. It's like a weird, strange mix of like pines and high desert bushes around. I don't know if I've ever really like experienced this type of desert terrain. 
it wants to be a forest, but it's just too dry, you can tell. What a view. Wow. All thanks to Tamara. Wouldn't have been possible without her. That's true. Say Definitely. thank you, Richard. Thank, thank you, Richard. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is a close-up of Tamara's hair. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm going to be real front. I have a feeling there's going to be a lot of naked people down here, and then I'm not going to feel comfortable getting any of this on video. So I'll see what I can do for you. But we got to play this by ear. No, it's fine. I got it. Slide down. <sighs> It was a little awkward earlier. There were some naked people. I couldn't get the camera out. That was a bubble. That was not a fart just now. <laughs> <laughs> um, but thanks, Tamara, for, for taking us. She's over yonder actually getting dressed. We're about to leave. So what are we doing now? <laughs> yeah, we've well, we got to figure out what we're doing. Get some more shots, show you guys the hot springs. Yeah, maybe get and, a couple. Uh, look at a wide open. Yeah. There's a couple pools up top. This was the pool we were in. That was awesome. It was a great first hot spring experience. Sorry I couldn't get more footage, but when there's naked people around, it's best to leave cameras out of the situation I found. Um, this is Rachel and Alex. Hello. And we're becoming fast friends. <laughs> <laughs> Very close quarters. We, we met them at the hot springs, and then they practically begged us for a ride out of here. Yeah, we wouldn't Don't give them back me. their clothes until they gave us a ride. Yeah, we they had a on. they had a park almost as far back as where we left the truck, mm -hmm. so they had them a to long walk in. Social distancing rules. Yeah, save our lives. Oh, yeah. I need an oh shit handle right now. Uh, yeah, oh like shit. <laughs> Day three on the drive back. <laughs> we just ran out of food. We ran out of food. I had to eat Richard's leg. Setting in. I wish you guys could really see what the roads were looking like right now. Um, oh. Let's try this out, actually. <laughs> Maybe forgot, forgot about windows. This is the bumpy road. My head is squished out a window. Okay, this was like the least dangerous part that we just went through. Hey, how are you feeling? Talking to me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so they're holding hands because they could die at any moment. <laughs> I'm shaking because of the cold, not because <laughs> I'm not scared. Here's the outside. Can't see the camera, so good luck. Hi. Hey gang. Hi. Hi. Earlier when I mentioned I wasn't doing filming just because of like the nakedness, it wasn't because we were naked, it was because there was other people that were naked. I just wanted to make that clear, okay? <laughs> just everyone's, you know, in the know now. Well, it's been real. It's been great. Thanks for keeping it weird with us. Uh, you're welcome. I'm sure we'll stumble into each other again. Maybe, on the road. It'll happen. Cool. All right, have fun. <laughs> it's been fun. Peace. Peace. Enjoy you your guys. life. <laughs> Bye. As soon as she was in her life, she was gone. Like dust in the wind. It's cool though, getting to meet random people on the road. Oh and yeah, I love adventure it. Adventure and just have a fun day, and then uh, say goodbye. Until next time. It's a bit windy. It's a bit windier. <laughs> Get off me, dust! Get off me, dust! I'm sacrificing. <laughs> Dusty wind for cold. <laughs> it's, oh, it's in my teeth. It's so windy. That's what oh. she said. <laughs> and this has a UFO watchtower, which has primitive camping adjacent to the watchtower in a store promoting alien encounters. That's where we gotta go. <laughs> we gotta go <laughs> check out that.